this red hot recap, I'm talking about why the NHL's dead puck era was actually amazing. The dead puck era refers to a period of time in the NHL, roughly from the mid to late 90s to the early 2000s, that is often criticized for its low scoring. I've heard people remark that this era was a bit of a snooze fest, but hear me out. There are a few really good reasons why the dead puck era was actually amazing. First of all, the low scoring and physicality resulted in a more defensive style of play, which placed a greater emphasis on team play and tactics. This made for some very close and seriously exciting games and countless memorable moments. Teams had to work together to break through the defense and create scoring opportunities, and it was so satisfying to see a well-executed game plan come together on the ice. People seemed to forget, during the dead puck era, we had the epic war between the Avalanche and the Red Wings, an all-time great goalie rivalry between Wa and Broder, and several American-born superstars flourished, including Mike Madonna, Brett Hall, and John LeClaire. Plus, don't get me started about all the incredible players from the epic playoff battles between the top teams in the league. Names like Sakic, Forsberg, Iserman, and Shanahan are just the tip of the iceberg. We also saw the rise of some seriously talented young players, like Iggy, Marian Hossa, and Pavel Datsuk. These guys brought a new level of skill and excitement to the game, and it was awesome to see them develop into some of the best players in the league. The dead puck era was also a time of fantastic parody. Critics seemed to forget, during the dead puck era, we witnessed several great Cinderella stories. The Hurricanes, Panthers, Capitals, Sabres, Ducks and Flames all made miracle runs to the cup final. Some would say the Sabres and Flames, especially the Flames, would have won the cup, if not for some shady officiating. Finally, and most importantly, it was during the dead puck era that we witnessed the glow puck, in all its glowing glory. So, while the dead puck era may not have been as high scoring as some fans would have liked, it was a time of great rivalries, talent, and parody in the NHL. Don't sleep on the dead puck era guys, it was amazing in its own right. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe.